Thank you, Phil Moore, I focus. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. I'm in manual, as usual. But Fujifilm autofocus. <laughs> it's the hot topic among Fujifilm users and Fujifilm haters. I've got a puzzling question. Fujifilm recently released firmware update 7.1, which is, uh, I think, and a lot of other people think, significantly improved the autofocus of the Fujifilm cameras, the top tier ones, because it's only available for the top tier ones. The X-H2S got it. The uh, top line medium format got it. How come we're not really hearing about it? There are YouTubers out there who are covering this, but they're pretty minor ones. For instance, JD Creatives. He has uh, one and a quarter thousand followers. He's done a test on the autofocus. He likes it. Jerry Gibraltar, uh, or Gibraltar, he's got 10,000 sub subscribers. He did a uh, test on the 7.1 firmware update. He thinks it's pretty good. Uh, Luca Petralia, he's got 10,000 as well. He did a good test on it. Omar Knows Photos, he's got uh, 2,300 subscribers. He did a test. Maz Zen, with a grand total of 46 subscribers. <laughs> did a good test on the autofocus. He likes it. Photo Rubs, he's got 10,000 subs. He likes it. And then, the only big one that I've seen do it, Camera Conspiracies. Good old Casey. Now, Casey readily admits he doesn't know what he's doing. But he does it with such a plum and bigger and humour. Even this guy, who admits that he doesn't know what he's doing and has struggled with the Fujifilm autofocus for several years. In fact, he's, he sold his Fujifilm system, I think, twice. I think he's on his third try. <laughs> and uh, he recently updated and instantly got much, much, much better results. He loves the thing. He thinks it's fine. With all these people, only one big YouTuber in that list who's tested the 7.1 firmware update and all admit that well a mix of oh it's up to Sony level to the majority saying it's almost there it is significantly better than anything else Fujifilm has put out because recently really it's just been embarrassing <laughs> each firmware update just makes it worse and worse and worse and then 7.1 comes out and just about everything is fixed why aren't we hearing other big YouTubers do this? For instance, Petapixel. I went and checked their videos because I was waiting for them to do something. It's been a month since they've done anything on Fujifilm. They covered the XM5 when it came out and the 500mm lens. As far as the 7.1 firmware update, crickets, nothing, zip. And these guys are supposed to be at the top of the game as far as testing camera gear goes. DP review. Well, it's been a whole month since they've done anything Fujifilm related. I think that was also the XM5. I could mention other big YouTubers who uh, should be on the ball. Why are they not even looking at this firmware update? If I was a conspiracy theorist, I'd say it's because they like the idea of Fujifilm being a failure in this regard. Fujifilm's great on all sorts of areas, but autofocus, nah, it drops it right down the list. You go on um, Sony, Canon, Nikon, even Olympus. <laughs> um, further down, you'll get Panasonic and Fuji. But now the game's changed with this new firmware update. The autofocus in Fujifilm is way, way better, and it's lifted it right up the list as far as other people who've tested this goes. So why is there silence from these other big guys? So yeah, I'm calling you out. Why are you not testing this? But yeah, this is much, much better. I'm a retired professional photographer, okay? I was a photojournalist, which means I covered all sorts of genres in one day. I could cover sport and action. I could cover community events. I'd be doing portraits. Uh, as well as the photojournalism gig, I also did my own paid work. I've covered weddings, 
family shoots. Uh, lots of things happening in the community around here. Paid work, commercial work. I have always used the Fuji films, the old ones. <laughs> okay, I have an XH1 and XT2. They were my two main cameras for covering everything, including, yeah, the sport and action stuff. Uh, Aussie rules, it's not exactly a slouch game. People, it's full on action and I uh, had to get out there with my X-H2 and X-H1 and successfully cover that. And I was using the old cameras, the old firmwares, and uh, back in the days when, yeah, Fujifilm autofocus was basically a joke. So I always shot manual focus, always. Why was I doing that? Because I'm comfortable with it. I'm old. I grew up with old film cameras. For photojournalism, I used to use the Olympus OM-1. Everything was manual. <laughs> okay, that's the way I grew up using cameras. That's the way I'm comfortable with. It's the way I know. It's my default setting, manual. So uh, for me, the uh, problems with the Fujifilm autofocus were pretty much irrelevant because I don't use it. I don't use automatic focus. Uh, in single or continuous. I use manual lenses, so I would use old film camera lenses. I would use third-party manual lenses. Hello TT Artisan, I'm shooting on the 25mm F2 now. Manual, because you can't do autofocus. Fine by me, <laughs> but a lot of people, no, they rely on autofocus. The Fiji film autofocus was a hair-tearing joke. However, it's no longer that it works but you won't hear it from the big guys. And my question is why? Why are these guys ignoring this or actively staying away from it? Hmm? So yeah, good news about the firmware update. If you've got the latest and greatest Fujifilm cameras, I would like to see the trickle down effect, please. My, the, the, the newest camera I run, I'm filming on right now is the XE4. Could we please have the autofocus trickle down to that? What about uh, the medium format? Okay, your, your top tier medium format cameras are getting updates with uh, better autofocus. What about my 50R here? I hope they, yeah, the, the older models get fixes as well because there's a heck of a lot of users out there with older Fujifilm. So Fujifilm, please do that bit of extra work. Keep going, fixing up these other cameras, the other lines you've got. Yeah, but the question still remains. This firmware update has made big, big, big changes to Fujifilm autofocus and the big guys on YouTube are ignoring it. So get your act together fellas because it's just not acceptable. Why are you ignoring this? But whatever camera you got, whatever autofocus <laughs> firmware you're using, pick it up, take it for a walk and have some fun. Bye.